What's going on guys, App Warrior here. Today I'm going to be doing another Minecraft video, so let's head in. Alright, um, so as you guys probably know, last time, um, we finished the wall and we made a pathetic attempt at doing the flooring. Um, so yeah, let's just kind of do that in this video. So yeah, I don't I don't know really what to talk about in this video. Um, probably just like, um, I don't know. I'm just gonna talk about nothing, guys. So screw you. <laughs> no. Um. Well, I mean, we gained a few subscribers. Uh, we gained like uh, yeah, a few. We have 19 now. Um. So that's incredibly, incredibly awesome. Um, so yeah, this may take like the whole video, so just, uh, please stand by. Um, so yeah, I don't even know what to talk about. Um, one thing I think I'm going to be doing, I'm going to get that Smosh movie. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people know what Smosh is. Um, yeah, they made a movie, so I'm going to have to watch that recently came out so it's pretty cool um I don't, I don't know really like i have nothing to talk about um i recently got fallout new vegas um it's a pretty good game um the only reason i got it i saw on pvg peanut butter gamer um one of uh, the kind of easter eggs where you can actually find, um, uh, what did we call it, uh, aliens, so, that's pretty freaking sweet, um, but yeah, uh, oh my god, <clears throat> you can tell this video is gonna be terrible, um, also, I cannot wait to make another custom thumbnail, um, for, sorry, I just had to, like, my eyes are, like, pounding, because there is, I have like this allergy, or basically, um, my kind of eyes get swollen, um, so, yeah, they're not, it's, it's not too good when you're staring at a screen, like, super close up, two inches away from your face, um, so, yeah, and if any of you follow me on Instagram, um, I, uh, I'm going to be posting pick of my new beats that I got. So that's going to be incredibly fun. Funly. Stanley. Funly. Um, but yeah. Um, I'm just like, I'm super tired today. Um, and my eyes are uh, kind of, uh, yeah. It's so basically, I, I'm just going to describe the pain in like, like super detail um basically what it's like what it feels like is since uh there's a swollen lump in the back of my freaking eyeball it, it's pushing up against my skull it's just like oh my god like i know i said i was gonna describe the pain but i can't it's so undescribably it's just awful and it's not even the worst i've ever had right um uh, it's just I'm why it's just like why can't I just have the sneezing allergies? I'm pretty sure these are better than having fucking swollen lumps in your eyes. Um That's what I would assume. Probably better. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, this takes like look at that. Start in daytime. It's already nighttime now. Just to explode a bunch of blocks. I wish there was some sort of TNT I could help do this. That would be very, very helpful. So, alright, just destroying everything. Destroying my six with my woes. I don't know. So, I think this is gonna be kind of the flooring episode. Um, and next episode is definitely gonna be the moat. I'm gonna fill it with lava and stuff. So, yeah. But first, uh, we gotta think about, 
Vrus. Whoops. Yeah, I just uh, kind of feel it with obsidian. See, this is going to be an impenetrable for fortress. Fortress. It's, um. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to need um, complete obsidian floor so nobody can dig under it. And, like, say, oh, I came up. <laughs> I don't know. I, don't, I have no idea. But... I gotta show more energy in the videos, guys. Look at how much energy I have. I just drank 14 gallons of Monster and Red Bull. I just combined them. Because I am a Coca-Cola addict. What? I don't even know. Alright. Oh my god. This is gonna take so long, guys. I just hate breaking up the floor. I would rather just place the blocks down more than I would like freaking like breaking them it's so annoying it takes 150 years to do this crap do this crap and I'm pretty sure like once I, I got it I'm just gonna tap rapidly and just like yeah, I, don't, I don't even know see I don't get no sleep cuz y'all yeah I, I'm just gonna do that after cuz I gotta have to I'm gonna go full beast mode right now um, Full beast mode. This is not even full beast mode. I don't even know. <coughs> I don't even. <coughs> what was that? I don't. I don't even know. Booty going up. Uh, why am I saying that? I don't know lyrics to any songs, so work it makes us work it stronger. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I was watching this video, um, this YouTube channel uh, called Mr. Nightmare. I'm not sure if you guys have ever heard of him. Um, he's an awesome YouTuber. He does mainly creepy stuff um, that will make like really creep you out. Um, Chuck E. Cheese was trying to sue him, um, because he did this creepy pasta video, um, it was about, like, the mechanical mouse, uh, from Chuck E. Cheese, I guess it was Chuck E. from Chuck E. Cheese, or, <laughs> um, yeah, so, they tried to sue him, because it's kind of making their business out to be a, a bad place. Which is kind of ridiculous. It was be like creepy posters or posters. Um, they're just made to be kind of a joke. Um, just a scary story. Nothing too harmful. Um, I guess Chuck E. Cheese didn't take that too kindly, and they sent their living mechanical mouse out to kill him. <laughs> oh my god, that would be hilarious. Don't tell the truth about our company. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. So, um, I guess this is gonna be like a video where I talk about uh, every single YouTuber besides me. Alright, so let's see if I can name every single YouTube channel that has videos on it on YouTube. Okay, that may take maybe a few hundred thousand episodes. Um, maybe a few hundred thousand years. No, it's kidding. I don't know. But YouTube is a power company. They got fucking like so many freaking YouTube channels on their wait website. Website. But it's other people's channels, so I, I guess I don't even know. So many people use their websites, what I'm trying to say. It's the most popular website online, but well Google. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> uh yeah, so I think it's just right behind Google. Is there YouTube? Um I think the first sentence ever said on YouTube was, here I am, uh, in front of the elephants. I don't know. I think it was something. It was, it was around that, kind of, in that nature. Um, it was a video called Me at the Zoo. You can look it up. It was the first YouTube video ever. 
and it was of this guy who was at the zoo. He's in front of the elephants. It's a very short video. I think uh, YouTube at the time didn't like like back in 2005. Um, it's, maybe they had a time limit to their, um, YouTube videos. Because hmm. I know nowadays, like, I've seen videos that go for, like, 10 hours. It's insane. But those aren't exactly, um, you know, uh, good videos to say. I mean, it's not really entertainment. It's just, like, like, here's Neon Cat for 15,000 hours. Um, I don't know why would they, why would they even do that? Nobody knows. I'm Jamaican. I'm a Jamaican prince. Alright. We are making so much progress. I bet, like, I mean, we're probably running out of time on the video. I, I just said that, uh, there's no time limit. I just, like, don't want to, my videos go to, like, 20 minutes. I don't know, I keep them around 15 minutes, maybe a little bit under, a little bit over. But never over, I think there was one over 20 minutes, but that was a mistake. I'm so sorry. Why son of a stepfather, I'm so... I just, like, I don't, like, I'm copywriting music. Because, like... People can't even tell the difference. That's how good of a singer I am. Like, I'm just like, is that Imagine Dragons? Um, or I can sing Justin Bieber. Like, is that Justin Bieber? What a faggot. <laughs> no. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, no. I'm not ripping on Justin Bieber. He's he's alright now. I mean, yeah, he, he kind of... <sighs> he changed. Like, into something completely different. But it's still a terrible change. Like, people still hate him. Because what he changed into was even worse. He, he, he went from a girl to a douchebag, drug addict, fucking, oh shit. Um, juvenile, to, like, say the least. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I mean, he, he's alright, I guess. <laughs> I just like ripped on him so bad I called him juvenile but you know he's alright <laughs> no uh, I don't know you don't thank the lord you thank the whites white people I don't know if you know where that's from uh, please say in the comments cause I don't know where it's from no, I'm just kidding. um uh wait Ooh, ooh, family got a class of stuff. <laughs> oh, ooh, I just gave away where that saying was from. Like, I, I actually don't think the Lord's Thank the Whites was a musical number in none other than Family Guy. Um, I think it's Baby Got Black. It's where Chris um, kind of is in love with a black girl. <laughs> yeah, I'm in love with a black girl. Um, but, yeah, and then Jer it's Jerome's daughter, so, he's like, no, I don't want my daughter named, oh my god, I do such a good impression, but no, uh, he's, he's like, I don't want my daughter dating a white boy, and like, yeah, it's kind of Peter singing about how, don't, like, like, just like, respect whites, cause, we're not as bad as our ancestors that enslaved you. Um, so, uh, yeah. Okay. Um, but what was I just gonna, I don't know. So, on another note, I don't know what note it is, but, um, on another note, um, uh, I, I was recently looking for this, uh, like, video um, it was, uh, this VHS tape, um, not porn, um, you can find a lot of VHS porn, I mean, like, it's just a lot, oh my god, but, <laughs> uh, no, I was actually looking for this old, 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 uh, video from, uh, uh, VHS from 1992, it's called Fall That Goblin, um, it's basically a claymation, it is a very, very, 
very rare Halloween video. Um, it's just, it's enjoyable. Um, even till this day, um, I, I watched it when I was freaking four or five. I still like it. Um, I'm almost 13 now, so, um, yeah, that says stuff. Um, yeah, it's, it's very enjoyable. That's what 90s does to people. Like, like, you think, oh, I'm not gonna enjoy that. I was from the, like, that was when I was a little kid in the 90s. And then, like, you go back and just, like, Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so enjoyable. But I wasn't even born in the 90s. I was born in like the end of the 90s. Which was like the early 2000s basically, guys. Like, see how, how like decades work is like, even millenniums, um, basically, um, <laughs> uh, oh my god, what's wrong with my arm? <laughs> it just started hurting, but, uh, yeah, like, the early 2000s, like, probably just, like, 2003 is when, like, 90s was dying off, and 2000s was being born in the 21st century. Um, it started off as such a high note, but, and then it just turned to complete shit. <laughs> um, yeah, our generation is fucked. Um, but, yeah. I don't know. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 28. I also like watching Futurama. Um, that's another thing. Um, <laughs> that's another thing. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, I was watching this one episode. I don't know if anybody, uh, knows. Uh, like, you know, it's, I, if you watch the whole series, you might remember it. Futurama is such a good show. You just remember certain episodes. You remember most of the episodes. Once I start to explain it, it's uh, the late Philip J. Fry is what the episode's called. Basically, um, it starts off. Uh, Fry is he's like you get the impression he's late for everything, and uh, so he shows up to work late because a bender was keeping him up all night. He was partying. He was like. I don't know how robots have sex, but I guess he was having sex with a robot girl. Um, I think they have sex with their antennas, but that's besides the point. Um, so yeah, he was all late, um, late to work, but then, um, he's like, where's Leela? And she's like, um, well, she's probably getting stood up by some dick bag. And, uh, he realized that, yeah, he... You, like, said, oh, let's go on a date at that time, but he was late, um, so, yeah. So, she's mad at that. He tried to do it again, uh, like, reschedule the date. Um, then, uh, it basically, um, since he was late, he had to test out, um, the professor's time machine. Um, so, yeah, he while he was doing that... Uh, Leela got the impression that, like, since she was stood up again, um, she thought he was going to this party that they saw on TV, um, this famous robot, um, he was, uh, having this enormous party, um, so she, uh, she thought he was going to that, but he was really traveling in time, um, so, yeah, but then you see that, um, on the TV that, like, the party ended in big tragedy. So she thinks that, uh, uh, Bender, uh, the professor and Fry, um, got, like, killed at that party. But they're really traveling through time. It's a one-way time machine. It only goes in the future. So, yeah, they just went in the future. He's, uh, wanted to give her another car, a uh, card. Um, when he was in the, uh, time machine, uh, one of the things, like, so he was basically, um, gonna give her a card, uh, record your own message card, and then, like, the time machine just flipped out, and, um, yeah, it, the card flew out the window, and another cool thing, part, like, uh, uh, <laughs> for the episode, is, like, so, you see how, um, 
it, like a lot of time has passed, been like 50 years without the professor Bender or Fry, and uh, basically Leela runs the company Planet Express. Um, they're just thriving. They got like a bunch of ships. Uh, they're like UPS, like of the future. Um, so she, uh, like the card that he was gonna give to her. Um, when he, um, after he's done testing it out, but then they, like, kind of went, they were supposed to go in a minute in time, but then they went, like, a thousand years, so, yeah, she got hit in the back of the head, as soon as it flew out the window, it flew, like, in the back of Leela's head, since she was, um, in the future, I don't, it's hard to explain, um, I'm terrible at explaining things, so sorry, guys, but, yeah, they just go forward in time, and, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's it's a good episode, just trust me. Just look up on Netflix, the late Philip J. Fry, and you'll like it. So, hold on, I gotta just kind of, uh, complete this off-camera, um, this whole freaking thing. So, see you in a little bit. And I'm back. So as you can see, a fairy came and dropped all these blocks on the floor. And yeah, it's pretty f fucking swag. <laughs> um, so yeah. Um, this is probably gonna be the end of the video. Um, right here. Um, I just kinda did all this. This took a very long time. I ended at night time. It's actually a few Minecraft days ago that I, I left off. <laughs> so a few days ago I left off. But they were Minecraft days, so they're not real days. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. We'll be building the moat. And peace out.